Hi guys, very quick video. So this uh, volcano on Hawaii is um, the lava is overflowing its crater again. It lasted so in 2015. Um, the only reason I think this is significant is because this last activity started on April the 22nd, and it's um, the Kilauea volcano in Hawaii. And I think that connects to the IPEC goat video with the Obama scene here. The V that forms on Obama's forehead in this uh, sweat droplet, and it looks like the V could connect to even a number five if it's a Roman numeral. Or the number 22 if it's going by the uh, alphabet. And um, if it is going by the number 22, then you've got a V which could stand for volcano and V which could stand for 22, both of which have, uh, you know, correspond with this particular report, 22nd of April, um, volcano overflowing its, its crater. The issue there is it could, the potential for it to, you know, escalate is something that they're looking at. The odds are low, but activity like this can be an early indicator of bigger things to come. And bigger things to come could be like a Vanatu type um, forced evacuation of a volcanic island, which has just happened in the last couple of days. In this report, mass evacuations are underway in Vanatu after a state of emergency was declared on Ambe Island due to volcanic activity. So if this has happened in the last couple of days where 11,000 people have had to be removed from their homes because of uh, a volcano, it could be that maybe if this is a sign of bigger things to come, something bigger might happen in Hawaii, resulting in, uh, you know, forced evacuation of all the residents or, you know, some sort of catastrophe, maybe, hopefully not, but it's possible. And obviously that just makes me think of this scene because we have on the apple, the volcano, which appears to be erupting. And then we get this split. So in reference to volcanoes, it could be Yellowstone, La Cumbre Vieja, um, Stromboli in Italy, um, the Kilauea, the Kilauea volcano in Hawaii. There's many different volcanoes that pose different different risks. Um, in connection with this particular scene, you've got the Stromboli volcano in Hawaii. Uh, sorry, in Italy, which is just next to, like, Italy is shaped as a boot, so the volcano is just next to the boot of Italy. Which again, we have the apple and the volcano next to the boot of Obama, so that could be that connection. Then you've got the LCB, which could be La Cumbre Vieja Volcano, or just La Cumbre Vieja, which again is in Spain, so Italy and Spain, and that's another connection. Then you've got uh, Yellowstone, um, obvious obvious uh, super volcano to be watching out for, and now you've got the Kilauea Volcano in Hawaii, which uh, obviously has connections to Obama, because that's where he's from. So that's why this video is just going to be called earthquakes and volcanoes because there's a lot of things going on at the moment but i just wanted to bring out that particular point because it seems like it has a connection to this video as well and then you've got the earthquakes part of this video which is again another earthquake striking california shaking um los angeles and this is just on the lookout for the big one that they're supposed to be, um well has been saying for a long time is on the way and that just again connects me to the ipad code video in this psalms 23 particular scene where it appears this, I've interpreted this as a Richter scale needle and um, starts off all right and then goes off the Richter scale. And that would be something that happens in the big one of magnitude nine or above on the Richter scale. A lot of earthquakes happening at the moment, a lot of volcanoes awakening and uh, volcanoes, you know, awaken due to magma movement and magma movement is either a result of or caused by earthquakes. And those earthquakes obviously spread around the world. The energy doesn't just disappear, it dissipates, so it spreads around. And um, when there's one volcano, sorry, one earthquake in one place, there's generally going to be an earthquake in another place, maybe a couple of days or a week later, as the energy makes its way across the tectonic plates of the earth. Then we have the references to Yellowstone again. Yellowstone is not erupting, but there's this video that's been recently posted online of something unusual taking place at Yellowstone in reference to something something like a light or something coming out of Yellowstone um, and then emergency crews arriving on the scene and there appears to be something that they're looking at on the ground could be a person I don't know a person could have been injured at Yellowstone or something happened over there I don't know because there's no real reports by only this video you can see the light over here has come up and is you know coming forward flash flash it's like a meteorite but it's not Obviously, it's traveling too slow. 
there's various explosions and um, if you didn't see when it was rising up uh, you can see it just from here this is the light here kind of rising up out of the I don't know beyond the ridge or out of the ground you can't really tell because it's too dark and basically I'm only showing this video because I'm just interested to know what you guys think you know it kind of comes up and then you know goes around in a little bit of a circular kind of pattern and then you know shoots forward it could just be CGI. Obviously, we live in a techno technologically advanced age, so people could just be messing around with um, imagery and you know video. But if it is real, it'd be interesting to know what it is. So let me know what you guys think about that. Again, just quick video, particularly in relation to this volcano that's going on, um, this lava rising. Well, um, event that's happening at the Kilauea volcano in Hawaii, and how Hawaii obviously connects to Obama. This started on April the 22nd. That could connect to the V on Obama's head. That could this situation. I don't know. It could just settle back down like it has before, or it could be, as they've said, um, odds are low, but activity like this can be an earlier indicator of bigger things to come. And obviously, if it is an indicator of bigger things to come, how big those things get may result in. Um, an evacuation of a volcanic island like we've had in the last couple of days on Vanatu um, or you know it could connect in other different ways so you guys have a good morning good afternoon good evening and God bless